good morning students we were discussing chapter number 2 population dynamics we had seen different uh, parts of this one population and different countries and last class we were discussing population pyramid of different countries we had seen population pyramid of kenya and people population pyramid of india both we compared what is the what is the difference between population pyramid of kenya and india in population pyramid of uh, kenya birth rate and death rate both are high that means from the base you see uh, uh, from the base to top from the base it is very broad but uh, when it uh, comes up age uh, 70 75 it is very narrow that means uh, uh, that means large percentage of many children are born a large percentage of them die in the uh, infancy that is happening in kenya large number of large percentage of infants is are li- dying in their infancy so that is why young people are very less we are coming up what happens the uh, young force till after 40s they don't have the uh, the proper health care that may be the reason see that it is very less that means death rate is also very high only very few old people live adults and very old people only percentage what two percentage but you see the india's condition here um, death rate in countries where death rate um, that means especially amongst very young is less than the birth rate the pyramid is broad in the younger age groups because more infants survive to adulthood that is the condition of india that is the force of india that is a system of india because our health system is improved because uh, we are a developing country yes or no that is my uh, like kenya is an undeveloped country underdeveloped country and they don't have proper health and uh, work forces now see so um, death rate is not that much high as kenya in india death rate is there at the age of uh, what it narrows from young age to old age it narrows but still what happen young people are more that means uh, almost infants born survive to adulthood that is the difference okay so uh, that means uh, like uh, india's like pyramid like india uh, that means uh, large number of young people and uh, young people survive to the adulthood that means they live they are the expa- uh, showing they are very important part of labor force now um, we, let us see the uh, population pyramid of uh, japan where birth rate and death rate is very low yes or no where birth rate is low the pyramid will be narrow at the base and the, the death rate also very low so that is the reason very large number of people very large number of people what uh, reach in the old age they very, uh, very old uh, very old people very large number of people reach to the reach old age because death rate also very low so so what happen uh, there pyramid will show look at the pyramid uh, uh, death uh, death rate in uh, death rate is very low in infancy that means 0 to 4 same way uh, same way the death rate in age between 15 to 70 is also low in japan 
so skilled and spirit skilled spirited and hopeful young people endowed with a positive look outlook are the future of any nation we in india are fortunate to have such a resources that the young people resources they must be educated and provided skills and opportunities to become able and productive when a country is product when a one country when a country become a productive when the young force young people are more energetic and ready to do the work because of if we give opportunities to the people what happens normally they become very productive so it is very important the young, young people are very important part of a country so they become more productive india's case you see compare india and japan because young force is more in india than japan that is why india stands in front of many other countries our young force is more see age between um, uh, 14 to just 30 you compare that young force is more than japan so india stands before the country before many other countries in front of many other countries so you just read and understand thank you so much